This is the situation here. Christians and Muslims are suffering. It's not justice in here. It's not democracy in here. We are treated like a low class people here in, uh, in this country, in Israel. We face all kinds of discrimination everywhere, wherever we go. I feel like I don't belong to here. You are asking Israel if it treats Christians or Muslims different. No, it's exactly the same. We are under the same occupation. You don't have like a human being right. And is this all Christians generally or? Anybody who is like not Jewish, I think. The Muslims protected the Christians, protected the churches, and that's why churches are existing. Muslims could have destroyed, you know, all of the churches and killed all the Christians 800 years ago. Go to Bethlehem scene, shops beside the others, Muslim and the Christian. You know, the Middle East, you know, and uh, this whole area, you know, many minorities lived under Islam. You know, even Jews, you know. We all know that Jews were protected by Muslims in Morocco, Algeria, and Tunisia from the Christian Inquisition. No, they did not pay taxes, you know, when the Muslims came. Church has been closed because uh, the uh, Jerusalem municipality uh, charged the churches here uh, a tax on the a property tax, which was about uh, 190 million dollars. After 50 years, she changed the law and make us pay taxes from the beginning of the Israel existence till today. When the Israeli government closed the Al-Aqsa Mosque, there is a lot of Christians was standing side by side with Muslims. The same as well when they closed the Church of Holy Sepulchre. You could find a lot of Muslims are standing with their brothers, Christians. With the high taxes will become a very heavy burden on Christians. But they just like living on donations, they can't pay taxes. The whole story is about one thing. The Israelis stole our land. That's the whole story. It's political problems, not religion problems. Peace be upon you. From Jerusalem, the center of peace.